हेलो फ्रेंड्स हेयर इज येट अनदर अमेजिंग प्रॉब्लम ऑफ डिस्टेंस स्पीड एंड टाइम एंड दिस क्वेश्चन एग्जिस्टेड इन वन ऑफ द प्रीवियस ईयर कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम्स एंड यू नीड टू सॉल्व इट इन मिनिमम अमाउंट ऑफ टाइम्स सो लेट्स सी द प्रॉब्लम फर्स्ट द रेशियो ऑफ स्पीड ऑफ बोट इन डाउन स्ट्रीम मोशन एंड दैट ऑफ अप स्ट्रीम मोशन सो द रेशियो ऑफ द स्पीड इन द टू टाइप्स ऑफ मोशन इज गिवन एज नाइन रेशियो सेवन एंड it is also given that the speed of stream is 3 km per hour and you need to find the distance traveled upstream in 5 hours so obviously if you have to calculate the distance traveled then you should know the speed and time time is given 5 hours so you should know the speed so how do you find the speed of the boat in upstream motion now for this see the ratio of downstream and upstream motion the ratio of the speeds is given as 9 ratio 7 so how do you solve this in minimum amount of time so whenever we are given the ratio we assume them by pre uh, suffixing an x here so speed of boat downstreams so this is to be assumed as 9x and uh, speed of boat upstreams this is to be assumed as 7x so these are the two things which is uh, you know which are assumed based on the given ratio and now the important thing speed of stream is 3 km per hour so how do you find the speed of stream so whenever you have to find the speed of stream then you use a shortcut downstream speed minus upstream speed upon 2 now that is the short trick you should know so i'll mention here this is the short trick for finding the speed of stream okay so speed of stream here it is mentioned that it is 3 km per hour downstream speed is 9x and upstream speed is 7x upon 2 so from here you have this 2x upon 2 which means x is equal to 3 km per hour now this is the value of x now once we know the value of x then after this simplification will be very easy so you will be able to find the speed of boat in downstream motion and in upstream motion but we need only upstream motion because we have to find the distance traveled upstream therefore speed upstream is see the speed upstream it is 7x so 7 into 3 it is 21 km per hour now you need to find the distance and what is the formula for distance distance is speed into time now speed is already calculated upstream because here it was given upstream so 21 multiplied by time time is given as 5 hours so very easy distance is 21 into 5 this is 105 kilometers so this is the shortest possible method of solving this question and you need to be aware of this method otherwise you will be consuming a lot of time in calculating the speed of the boat in upstream motion so friends if you like this video do share it with your friends and do not forget to subscribe the channel also for more such amazing short tricks to solve such important questions